Ireland, Scotland at the weekend. Uh, plenty of changes. It's been a long international break. Plenty of changes needed. Stephen Kenny said he will make changes for the weekend. Where do you see what area, what sort of players do you see him bringing in? Um, freshness, I suppose. Um, the manager would, would, would admit that. The players who started the first two games haven't looked the sharpest. It hasn't been the most enthusiastic of, of performances. So he'll be looking for players to come in. And now it's an opportunity for the guys sitting in the hotel that maybe thought they weren't going to get a, a, an amazing amount of minutes in the strip. All of a sudden they're going, I could be starting. And it's your chance to stick your hand up. Um, and stake a claim and, 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 and add some enthusiasm to, to the team. So I fully expect to see the likes of Alan Brown come into the team. You know, I mean, he is a high energy player, runs forward, passes forward, capable of scoring the odd goal. Um, and I suppose when you look around at um, Daryl Shea, I, I think will come in. Um, but I think the biggest thing I'm looking for on Saturday is the shape of the team that he goes with. You know, if he sticks with the, the, the three, four and the flat three up front, or if he brings in some, some sort of a hybrid where the wide players are inverted to give the midfield players a dig out and just to close off a little bit of that space. Whether he goes with two number sixes um, or he goes with Josh Cullen and, and a number eight and Jeff Hendricks maybe or, or Alan Brown. Um, I think that was a, a mistake the other night. And up front, we're struggling for goals. Michael Obafemi has been banging them in for Swansea. Well, go, yeah. He's come back into the squad. Is it his turn now for a shot up front? Has Stephen Kenny sorted how he wants to play his front men, do you think? Um, I think Obafemi is definitely going to play, absolutely. I think he's probably the, the, the first change that's going to come in um, and because we need goals and he's having a good season, obviously, and he had a good cameo off the bench the other night. So I think he'll be one of the ones in. Um, I suppose how he organises them, I mean, I suppose you want to give... You want to give it your, your attacking three freedom, you know, to, to run across the line. A, a Bennett does that quite a bit where he runs inside and, you know, runs outside. Maybe a bit more structure to the front three to create more cohesion in the team. Maybe that's something you'd want to look at. Um, but there's plenty of things to improve on and plenty of scope for improvement. So I'm looking forward to the game on Saturday and I'm sure the manager and the players are too. Fingers crossed for a win.